<clears throat> hey guys, it's Andy here, uh, doing my much anticipated January 2012 update video. Now, before we begin, I do have to, to uh, apologize for the ambient room noise and the music and all that other stuff. But I am in Starbucks, and the reason being is so I can get this video uploaded to YouTube as quickly as possible. So, with that said, uh, let's dig right in to uh, what's all going to be happening this month and this year, I should say. Um, first off, it's great to be back in San Diego again. Um, I really did enjoy my time back home in Ohio. Got, you know, got to see my friends, got to see my family, got to see my puppies. And, uh, yeah, just fun was had by all. And I uh, had a great Christmas. I got a new camera, a new point and shoot, so for future concerts and stuff like that, I won't have to get, you know, I won't be hassled as much because it's a point and shoot instead of an actual like video camera like my St. Exacti is. And it does take really good uh, quality video. If you saw my uh, my demo of it, um, it's pretty good. I've yet to test it out in a concert environment, so I'm not sure exactly how it handles high noise and stuff like that, but I have seen others, other uh, concert footage using that camera, so I know that it can uh, do very well. So I can't wait to, uh, <laughs> to test it out on an actual concert, and uh, hope to get uh, footage of that up soon. And uh, yeah, speaking of which... Um, if you've uh, been paying attention to my vlogs and update videos and stuff like that, um, you'll know that in an effort to make partner this year, because that's my big goal for uh, YouTube is making partner this year. And uh, in order for me to do that, I have to move all of the stuff that YouTube has tagged at, for copyrighted material, mostly songs. I have to move that stuff to my secondary channel, which is youtube.com slash theandysong. So it won't be gone forever. Um, I just moved it, and uh, I'm also going to be putting uh, in the future. I'm going to be putting uh, all my concert videos and uh, stuff like that onto that channel, so that way uh, I won't have to move everything over again. <laughs> It'll just be you know, I'll just be uploading from there, and uh, that's it. So, and I'll also be putting up uh, playlists on my main channel, which is uh, YouTube.com/slash Andyson of uh, stuff from my secondary channel so you'll still be able to see it even if you're subscribed to just my main channel you'll just have to go to like the playlists and uh, be on your merry little way so there's that um, let's see what else oh yes um, because I recently got a new camera I am toying with the idea of doing picture blogs or like picture blog posts um, I'm not sure if it'll be like super in depth you know I'm not sure if uh, I'll put like a lot of pictures up per post, or do like a one picture a day sort of dealio. Um, I'm still kind of toying with the idea in my head, uh, so definitely let me know what you guys think uh, in the comments below, and uh, I'll see if I can oblige, and uh, let's see what else is on the agenda here. Oh yes, uh, the status of Love Hina Abridged. Now I know I've been a... <laughs> promoting the series for a long time and building it up, building it up, building it up. But uh, especially with the holidays, um, I had to kind of halt production on it just because, you know, everybody was going to see their family and it wasn't really a good time to cut lines or anything like that. So uh, I had to kind of halt things for the time being. And uh, right now, it is pretty much what it was, you know, it's almost done. I just have to work on lip flaps and fine tuning and stuff like that. And uh, once that episode is done, then uh, we'll begin work on uh, episode two. Which, uh, speaking of which, um, the original voice for Shinobu had to quit the project due to uh, personal reasons. Um, definitely wish her the best in all her future endeavors and things like that. But I am also looking for a uh, possible replacement for her. So uh, I'll put more info and stuff like that in a future video. But I won't really address it too much until we get the uh, first episode up at least. So that way uh, you guys kind of know what I'm looking for in a character. Alright, I got a mint stuck on my tooth. <laughs> Anyway, um, 
So that's pretty much what's going on with the uh, Lofina Bridged. Um, I'm also toying with the idea of possibly getting a co-editor because, uh, to be honest, I really don't like editing lip flaps. They're very annoying, They're ve it's very tedious, and it takes a lot of time. So I definitely can sympathize with, you know, the high-end abridgers like uh, Team Four Star and stuff like that as far as, you know, getting the lip flaps synchronized and things like that, so, um, I think by episode two I'll have a better idea of what I'm doing, but honestly, <laughs> with the first episode you don't really know what, you don't really have like a process or anything like that, you know, keep in mind this is my first, uh, attempt at a bridge series, so a lot of, uh, elements from the first episode may not be carried over in future episodes, so just, uh, Keep that in mind when when it comes out, and uh, try not to be too harsh. You know, Ooh, the lip flaps aren't exactly you know precise. Whatever. So anyway, moving on. Uh, yes, <laughs> a series that everybody has been begging and pleading and sending me messages and comments and stuff about me uh, bringing back up is uh, Impax. And I am proud to say that I am uh, going to be starting work on some new episodes of that as well. Um, I got some new questions and just kind of... I want to kind of start the series, you know, with like a new concept, basically, you know. I'll still be answering questions and doing that sort of thing, but in addition to answering your questions, I'll also be kind of showing... Uh, it's kind of hard to explain, but kind of showing... Uh, giving you an idea of basically stuff you won't really think of, you know, when you're joining the Navy. Like maybe, you know, kind of show you like the bus schedule if you're stationed in San Diego or, you know, just stuff like that. I wrote down a, a bunch of ideas on another WordPad document that I don't have up right now. Uh, but, you know, just stuff like that. And I'm also thinking about uh, possibly doing update videos, or updated, I should say, updated uh, versions of NFAX that I already have up, just because, you know, policies change, and to be honest, some of the, uh, the very early episodes I'm not too proud of, just because, I don't know, just, you know, I'm, I sound like I'm reading off the screen, which I am, or was, I should say, and uh, I kind of want it to be a bit more, I kind of want the production value to be a bit better, as far as, uh, just overall, sound, video, uh, just my talking, and uh, you know, I want to have a, a better prepared answer and things like that. So I'm not going to be deleting any episodes or anything like that. I'll just I'll keep the old episodes up, but I'm also thinking about uh, just bleh, <laughs> about uh, doing updated versions of those episodes as well. So let's see what's next. Oh yes, I am toying with uh, some review video ideas as well. Uh, possibly thinking about doing like uh, reviewing uh, current issues of Guitar World. I'm gonna be uh, recording kind of a uh, like a pilot version of that um, this month for uh, the January 2012 issue. So, so you know, it's it's, the, it's an idea I'm thinking of. Um, I don't know if it's gonna take off or not. But we'll, we'll see where it goes. And in that same vein, I'm also thinking about reviewing uh, autobiographies of musicians. So, there's that. Um, I definitely have a good uh, set <laughs> of books to review for that. So, I definitely have a good, uh, good uh, inventory, I guess, of material. So, yeah. Um, also, more reviews. <laughs> um, I'm thinking about doing a three-part review of uh, the, the uh, series Misfits. Um, I'll be reviewing each season per episode, per uh, part, I guess. So it'll be a three-part series because there's only uh, three episodes. There are three seasons out, I should say. And uh, hope to have that out either this month, next month. Basically, like an in the future thing. So, yeah, let me get. <laughs> they're still done first. As well. uh, let's see. Next up, oh yes, quitting Twitter. Um, this was this wasn't that big of a deal to me, to be honest, because 
I was looking through my analytics, traffic, and stuff like that, and uh, not a lot of people have been following me on Twitter as far as actually clicking on the links that I put up and following my blog through Twitter. So I just quit just because, for me, it was a waste of time. I didn't really, you know, I wasn't really able to engage my audience because it seemed like the people that were following me were following me just to uh, get their follower count up. You know, it was basically like a sub for sub sort of deal. Whereas, you know, they may be hawking their own stuff, and I might, I might not uh, agree with it, or particularly like it. So <laughs> it seemed kind of pointless for me to follow them just because they follow me. So I had to. She's the I don't know. I just I didn't really didn't like Twitter that much. I mean, at first it was great because it was basically microblogging, and I kind of liked that because I didn't have to update my actual blog as much. So I got a lot less random posts on my blog and kind of converted those over to Twitter. So I liked that in the beginning, but when it came to actually uh, marketing my blog and getting it out there, it just didn't really work for me. I wasn't really able to connect with my audience. They all seemed to kind of be doing their own thing, be hawking their own products. It seemed very, uh, I don't know, it seemed very disconnected for me anyway. So I'm hoping, you know, I am hoping to uh, spread the word of my blogs, my blogs, and stuff like that through other means, uh, namely Google+. Plus. That's one of the main ways you can uh, find updates about you know, future videos and stuff like that, as well as uh, something else I've been, uh, been recently uh, toying with, and that is uh, YouTube bulletins. And uh, I know that most people, you know, don't really subscribe, you know, to my channel and keep an eye on, like, my bulletins and stuff like that. You know, I'm kind of guilty of that when subscribing to channels. I just want to subscribe for the uploads, not so much for the bulletins, the likes, and all the other extra stuff that comes with it. But, in my case, uh... I'll be also doing like YouTube bulletins to let you know like the progress of videos and uh, things like that. You know, just basic checking in. You know, make sure you know I'm still alive. You know, I won't be doing you know quite as random of stuff. It'll just be strictly you know updates and things like that. So uh, there's that. Um, okay, next thing on the list, uh, I definitely got to give out a shout out to my uh, my bro. Rob. Even still, even he's uh, doing like glitch off, videos right? for she video games. Like um, he did like, a bunch like, of them on like uh, Red Dead Redemption you know I mean? like, she didn't, like, a couple months oh, back, thanks, as well as uh, some oh, Halo videos. Uh, like, he's, he's done a bunch of them. I can't really list them all off because there's so many. But I'll link. I'll put links and stuff in the down bar to his channel, which is YouTube.com/slash/Datris77. That's D-A-T-R-E-S. Seven, seven. So uh, definitely subscribe and uh, tell him that he sent you. <laughs> and uh, hopefully he'll put out more glitch videos in the future and stuff like that. And uh, let's see. The last thing on the list for this uh, update video is uh, new episodes of First Impact Anime. Um, if you've been following me, following me on uh, Google Plus, you'll know that uh, me and the Talking to Dolphin, also known as Ariopolis, uh, recorded one episode, one new episode of First Impact Anime, and we reviewed the uh, the first uh, Ava Rebuild anime. And, uh, yeah, it was kind of a throwback to our uh, roots. We also had a special guest on board as well, Starbuck. <laughs> And uh, I think it went very, very well. It was definitely a, kind of a, a back to basics sort of approach. Um, I did record it with uh, my Sanyo Zacti, though. I didn't really break out the can for that, just because for the for the movies they're a lot longer than the like the 20 minute episodes or whatever. So battery wise, I had to stick with the Sanyo Zacti because I could plug it into a power source and we didn't have to worry about battery life at all. But uh, it's still in HD. Uh, I still have to get down to editing it. We, you know, I have the audio and stuff like that. But I just had to, gotta get it, get down to editing it, syncing it with the video, and uh, trying to get an HD video actually. And I hope to have subtitles of it up on the uh, episode as well, so that way you guys 
can follow what's going on in addition to our comments without having to listen very carefully for uh, the audio in the background. So, uh, there's that. And uh, as far as future episodes of First Impact Anime goes, um, I don't know, it's, it's kind of up in the air. I really want to say that, you know, we're going to have a whole bunch of episodes out and, you know, we're going to have a whole second season and it's going to be awesome, but because of uh, distance and work schedules and things like that, um, it is kind of up in the air at the moment. I am hoping to do a uh, kind of like a Skype session with the Talking Vidalkin, so that way we can kind of, um, we can do our commentaries over Skype. I'll just record the, uh, the audio and stuff like that. From that, sync it up to the episodes. And uh, as far as intros go, there, you know, it'll be the same thing. You know, I'll be able to record the video and stuff like that. So hopefully, we'll uh, start up a new season of First Impact Anime. But right now, I'm not too sure. But in the meantime, uh, definitely uh, look forward to the uh, First Impact Anime episode where we review uh, Evangelion Redeath. The, uh, I think it's 1.11, the first one. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> Sorry if I'm a little... But, uh, yeah, that's all I got for uh, the January 2012 update video. So yeah, this is the Andy song. Signing off for now. Thanking you guys for tuning in to this uh, probably very long video. And uh, thanks for uh, sticking with it the whole way. <laughs> And for uh, liking, commenting, yeah. subscribing, sending a few friends to the party. And as always, we'll see you guys next time. Catch you later.